it's some title race, isn't it, at the moment. Tomorrow, Borussia Dortmund in action against Cologne. Uh, Dortmund, of course, had that extraordinary game last week, which saw Aaron Haaland come off the bench and get a hat-trick on his debut. Uh, Lucien Favre talking about the possibility of him starting. He hasn't trained for a long time. He has to keep working on his basic endurance. We should not forget that. He offered, offers a reference point for the midfield, but he's only 19 years old. Should he start, Stevie? Not if he's not physically ready, no. You know, the one thing with a, with a kid is you don't, you don't want to knock him down for any, any reason whatsoever. And this guy coming on with 30 minutes to go, when everybody else in the opposition has dropped a little level, I think is a perfect scenario. As he gets stronger, I think you can give him more time. Uh, and so it's a matter of when can he get 100% fit, and as soon as he is, then absolutely you start him. But couldn't you start him and then take him off if he's not? Uh, absolutely, I'd start him. Listen, you score a hat-trick on your debut coming off the bench. Um, listen, I understand the concern that he has to get match fit, but also Dortmund haven't been getting goals from the strikers. Jaden Sancho's their, their leading goal scorer coming from midfield. Royce with, with, with nine seconds behind him. You need that point, man. And I think Haaland gives him that. I'd, I'd start him, no question. Can I, start a, can I just ask a basic question? The guy's 19 years old, right? How much out of shape he could be right now? <laughs> he was running around the schoolyard I mean, just last well, week. <laughs> what if, honestly, what, I mean, how? what are we talking in terms of, well, he needs to get endurance and strength and stuff. Yeah. Come on, man. At 19, you just put the ball out there and play. I, I, I understand that there is something to making sure that you've trained and you're fully prepared. You don't want to risk injury. But when you have a guy that comes off the bench and scores a hat trick, how do you then tell him, Erlen, thanks but no thanks. Yeah. We think you're better off in the bench. Uh, Jules, it's been quite the week for him. Even England took notice of what was going on in Germany. Yes, massively over here. I mean, they, just to go back on the fitness, he had a little knee injury when they were on the training camp in Spain before the end of that, that winter break. And maybe that's why they, they want to take it slowly so you don't want maybe to him to aggravate that injury or something like that. But it was incredible. Although in Germany, you know, they still have that debate about the hat-trick because ah, they yeah. said... A real hat-trick is the one of just one half and uninterrupted, which is not what he did. So, uh, you know, but regardless, it's incredible to, uh, to score like that on his debut, like Obama Young did, by the way, against Augsburg as well in his first game for Dortmund back in 2013. But really, and as a PSG fan, I'm starting to get really worried on, on how much he can bring to that team going forward. Oh, yeah. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.